Hey guys, sorry it's been a while. I've been sick and, uh, you know, things happen. But uh, also, it's also been a while since I talked about the DCEU. Uh, a lot of shit, of course, happened since, you know, I last time talked about it. Uh, you know, the cancellation of Batgirl, what they're going to fucking do. Well, they, some plans have actually came through what they're trying to, what they're planning on doing. Uh, it looks like uh, they are going to get Henry Cavill and Ben Affleck to come back as Batman and Superman for this. They've pushed Flash back. Uh, to the summer, they've pushed Aquaman from March, you know, of it, uh, next year, all the way back to Christmas of next year. Uh, and they've also pushed Shazam back as well. So, you know, a lot of things have happened. Uh, and here's the thing. A lot of people are talking about, you know, what's going to happen. And they've also came out and said that Zack Snyder's uh, DCEU is dead. And they're not going to be resurrecting it. That they're in, in fact, they wish they never fucking released it. And that's because, you know, what it happens when you release things like that. Fans want more. And they want more of it. And here's what's going to happen. Okay, so they're bringing back Henry Cavill and Ben Affleck back as Superman and Batman. But you're not getting Zack Snyder verse basically back that is going to be true i think what they are going to do is when they do the flash movie because it has gotten great good reviews they are resetting everything you're going to keep the same actors but Zack snyder's vision and version of everything is going to be totally redone because it makes sense you have black adam coming out you have shazam you have aquaman you have these characters who in these movies that are already established and made but you can't but they're in the, in that universe already, so and it just makes more sense that you just refresh it. And to be honest, I think that is what they are doing. They're going to take the Flash movie, make it the Flashpoint movie, and reset everything that uh, that Zack Snyder did. It, it, it's going to keep the same characters, same actors, which is what we want. But also, it takes away everything that Zack Snyder did. So that way, you can erase everything bad. That he did with these characters. Like now you don't have to have fucking cyborgs. So you don't have Ray Fisher in there or anything like that. You can erase Amber Heard. You know. All the bad choices that were in the, that were made. Uh, the whole Doomsday Batman versus Superman. Maybe all that goes. You know all that bad Martha shit hopefully goes away too. Um, so therefore that way we keep the actors that we like. And you know Gal Gadot is Wonder Woman. Uh, Jason Momoa is Aquaman. Stuff like that. And, you know, erase it. And then they get, gave Ezra Miller, you know, a chance. Hey, get on track and maybe you, you say, keep the Flash. Even though I don't think that's what's going to fucking happen. I think he is still going to be out as Flash. But the thing is, by pushing that movie back to next summer, it in a lot of people's eyes, you know, people are very short. The, the masses are short-minded. They'll forget about all the fucking shit that's going on with him by next year. So that way they could probably put it out more better um, and then rearrange it. Uh, because the thing is, it's gotten good test screens. They don't want to fucking trash that film is what it is. And this way they can, like I said, keep the characters and everything. This is just my opinion, guys. I do want to hear what your guys' opinion is on this. Um, definitely leave it in the comment box below. If you're not a subscriber, by all means, subscribe to the channel, guys. And... What are your thoughts on this whole DC thing? Uh, what do you, you know, Ben Affleck and Henry Cavill coming back? Uh, looks like they're going to keep some of the main characters and get rid of the bad choices. That's just my opinion. Leave it in the comment box below. Till next time.